What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. This is Alex, MTV Alex, and today I got a little something different. Before we start, please, I would like to I would like for you to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so. If you haven't seen my uh, teaching channel, Mr. Gomez, I'll leave a link for you up here. If you haven't seen my other playlist, please make, make sure you check them out. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. If you want to support the channel, link down in the description. So let's get right into it. So if you've been following my channel, um, I think Monday, today is May 20th. This video might go out tomorrow, just as really quick. Um, on Monday, no, on Sunday actually, I got a box. I made a short because I got a box. Some of you might already know what it is, but here it is. That's right, after seeing that video from uh, Kev Central, I went ahead and bought me a Mongoose S XR Pro as well. And I know some other uh, guys that are doing the bike things going on, doing the same thing. Uh, I don't want to mention any names, but I do know that Chicken Cindy's did a video on today's Thursday, so that will be Wednesday. He made a quick video, I guess he wanted. That's great for him. Um, and actually, if you haven't seen that video, check him out because I'm actually thinking about the same thing. I don't know if I want to build this bike. As you can see, this is not going to be an unboxing video because I don't want to take it out of the box. He did mention something about this number right here. He said he got the 256 out of 256. I got 225 out of 256. That might be the number of Mongoose XR Pro that they are selling. So, this is the deal. As you know, many of you know, I got all that right there. So this will just add money. This will be another money pit. And I don't want to, I don't know if I want to spend that money. I already ordered some parts. I already ordered a fork. I already ordered the back suspension. I already ordered handlebars. I already ordered everything for this. And the, the, the number came up to almost a thousand dollars. And I don't even know if I really need this. So I'm thinking about just returning everything, all the parts that I bought, and just either keep the bike or actually assemble it and keep it as a future project. Now, I went ahead and got this bike because last summer, that was my bike that got me on the trail. That was my first project. I'll probably leave a link for you to the video where I talk about that project and I actually love the way the bike looked, okay? Now, my original idea was to get all the upgrades from the, uh, the TAF and put them into this one, but I got a taper four on that one. And I know you can do taper forks on straight uh, tubes, straight head tubes, but this one in particular, I haven't been able to find an adapter. The head tube is a 33.9 millimeter inside diameter. And in the 44 ones, you can actually get an adapter to make a straight tube, a tapered bike. And my friend over there at Tex-Mex is a guy from Mexico that does video. He has a video on that one, on a um, on the one that came after this one. It actually has a Hydroform, which is another great bike. This bike over here is perfect. I love it. Like I said, I don't know if I want you to return it. Or keep it and just put the project down to the side for a later time I don't know what to do like I said I don't I probably will not be riding this one like uh, as much I'm not even riding the Axum anymore I don't even know what to do with that many bikes and everything is coming out of my pockets because as you know I don't have a thousand subscribers because you guys are not subscribing and uh, I don't get any money from YouTube or any sponsors. I don't have any sponsors. I have not gotten any cups of coffee. That's okay. Everything's coming out of my pocket and I, it's actually taking a hit. So I really don't know what to do. Should I keep this bike? Should I return everything, everything that I already bought for this bike and just keep it as a future project or what to do? Again, I don't want to do the unboxing for that one. You can go ahead and check out Chicken Sanders videos. It goes into detail very, very much, just like I used to do at the beginning on my Axum build. It goes 
and I've done too many unboxing. There's actually an unboxing for the Polygon Cascade 4 for my wife. I just finished editing that video, so it's probably gonna go out mid at the early early weeks of next month, hopefully. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, this coming up tomorrow. Oh, today is Thursday. It's coming out on Friday. Tomorrow. Saturday, you're gonna get the other video for the the swing, not the swing, the Polygon D6 trail review that's coming out tomorrow. So make sure you stay tuned for that one. If you don't want to miss it, go ahead and make sure you hit the smash the notification bell on so you don't miss that content and any other future content. And again, I really don't know what to do about this bike. It just comes about comes down to the money. Uh, like with the bike and the parts that I already got, <clears throat> like I said, it's already a thousand dollars, and it's kind of like a mid, mid kind of budget kind of thing. I already have the railer, group set, crank sets, uh, hollow tech, bottom bracket, everything. But I don't know if I should just. I don't know. I, it just comes down to I have three kids, a wife, mortgage, and I don't have any money coming in from YouTube so <laughs> leaving down in the comments below what should I do uh, of course at the end of the day I'm gonna do whatever pleases me but I don't know I, I kinda like the bike so I'm really just thinking about just returning the parts and keeping this bike on the side because I like the way it looks but it's not gonna compare to my Cisco T8 at all so it's, they're two different levels even with the upgrades, it's not going to be at that level. The pivot points, they're not as good as the ones on my Polygon. So, to compare those two bikes is not fair, but that's my thing. It's like, I have a great bike, and I can make a good bike, but why do so if I already have a great bike? Uh, guys... Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. If you haven't, please go ahead and subscribe. It'll help me a lot. If you want to send me any parts, let me know if you're interested. I mean, on that, a lot, I know a lot of guys are, are doing it. Uh, Wolf Dick, they, they get a lot of parts. The Captain is getting some parts. Evan Saga is getting parts now. So, if you want me to, if you want to do something like that for me too, you're more than welcome. Let me know that in the comments below. And I'll give you my information. That's diesel barking. I'm not going to edit this video. Just going to go out. That's it for today, guys. And I'll see you on the trails. Goodbye.